Jeremy, thank you. East Tennessee State University is preparing for a few new programs coming to the campus. Those programs include Pharmacy Tech, Enneagram, and the ETSU Construction Summit. Here to tell us about the details is Ruth Taylor Reed. Welcome in. Thank you. Thank you for having me this morning. Well, let's start off with, uh, let's go with Enneagram. First of all, tell us about what exactly that is, kind of like a personality test. It is a personality test, and in this particular course, you um, not only learn about yourself, but you learn about how to interact um, more effectively with your coworkers or more effectively with any of the relationships in your life and it helps you understand why you react and why you behave in the ways that you do. It's fascinating stuff. And this is a class anyone can participate in, not anyone. just ETSU students. Um, how long does a course like this last? This one is a beginner course. We will graduate and do longer ones, but this one is April the 10th. It starts at 10 a.m. and goes until 3 that day. Okay. It's the basic fundamentals, and Dr. Googe is an excellent expert at both studying this, explaining this, and um, she's in our Department of Psychology at ETSU, so she's really good at this. And the other two classes that are new are definitely uh, uh, real-world applications, jobs that are definitely in demand in our area with Pharmacy Tech and the Construction Summit. Can you tell us about those? Certainly. Um, our Pharmacy Tech class starts in a few weeks. Um, we, it's certified through the National Farm Tech Board, and it enables you to work in any of the settings that a pharmacy tech would be um, interested in working in, whether it's a pharmacy or a hospital or out in the community where we, they serve the needs for the community. Mm -hmm. As far as the construction summit, we're excited about that because, to my knowledge, this is the first time we've done a construction summit, um, and it is May the 16th and the 17th, and it's for engineers and construction experts, people like that who can learn different aspects over the course of two days um, to increase their knowledge and to become even more of an expert in their particular field. Now you guys offer classes like these frequently, but why these topics this time around? Well, we were invited to um, help put this program together for the Construction Summit. Um, I have a granddaughter who's a senior in high school and she became fascinated with Enneagram studies and so she got so excited about it I thought well this would be a great opportunity to invite Dr. Googe to um, open this up for the community to learn how to be more effective in your daily life. Um, we do a lot of exciting things in the community as far as identifying local talent and bringing that talent to the awareness of the community. We've done um, ballroom dancing and uh, cookie decorating and art classes and just a lot of fun things as well as a lot of serious and educational oh, things. I love that. <laughs> <laughs> it's great. Well, you don't have to be an ETSU student to attend the class, but what kind of time commitment are we talking about for someone who wants to do this? Uh, depending on the class, the Anagram is a one-day class. It's several weeks to become certified as a farm tech. The Construction Summit is two days long. Um, uh, the dance class was actually two sessions on Saturdays to make it available for mm -hmm. everyone. Um, the art class was Tuesday, Thursday evenings for two weeks. You got four classes. It really just varies and depends on what the topic is. All right. Well, we are looking forward to all of these classes. Thank you so much. We have the information. If you are interested in any of the courses we talked about, you can register on ETSU's website. We also have it right there, the email and the phone number that you can reach out to. I mean, this is just so fun. Again, you do not have to be an ETSU student. We have some varying start dates, varying times for the series. You can check that all out. We'll be right back with a look at events happening this week.